Hi, my name is Lauren and today I'm going to go over how to set up and export your InDesign book file for use on the Entourage Yearbooks website. First, open up a new document in InDesign. You want to set up a couple custom settings before proceeding. You want to make the page size 8.5 by 11. Make sure to include the number of pages of your book file, as well as a 0.25 inch margin and a 0.125 inch bleed on each side. Once you have that set up, you can open up your document. I have one that I have already created in the background here. So you'll see it has my pages laid out, and you'll notice that it does include the margin safety line here in purple, the black cut line, and then the outermost bleed line where you should make sure all of your backgrounds are pulled to. It also gives an indication of the gutter or the place where the two pages will meet. Before exporting your InDesign document, make sure to embed your links. And you can do this by going to the links panel and you'll see all of my backgrounds and graphics are located here on the right. To embed a link is to ensure that the high quality version of the image will be exported in your PDF. So to do so, select all of the links at once and right click embed link. Once embedded, you'll see this icon here. That means that the image is now in your actual document instead of being pulled from a place on your computer. Once you're ready to export your book file, go to the top toolbar here under File, Export, and you'll see it already has Adobe PDF as the selected file type. Name your book file what you would like, Make sure not to use any special characters and then hit save. An export window will pop up and there's a few things that you wanna make sure are selected before exporting. Make sure to export all of your pages unless you are choosing to export only a certain page or page range. In compression, Make sure that by cubic down sampling to 300 for images above 450 pixels per inch is selected. And this is because we only require images to be 300 pixels per inch for printing. Anything larger than that will make your book file unnecessarily large and will take a longer time to export and to upload to our website. Marks and bleeds. Make sure that use document bleed settings is selected. This is to ensure that your book file exports at the correct size and when uploaded to the website, you won't get any page errors. Once you have ensured that all of those boxes are checked, you can hit export. This may take a few moments depending on how large your book file is. You can now see that my book file has loaded and the Adobe PDF has appeared. To upload it to the Entourage Yearbooks website, go to Manage, Manage Uploads, and this is where you'll upload PDFs. Click Upload File, and find the PDF on your computer. Select the content type, and hit Upload File. Once the upload is complete, Hit view this file. Once the page previews have generated, which could take up to several minutes depending on how big your book file is, you'll see them below. When you're ready to put them on your yearbook ladder, hit submit pages. You'll see you now have the option to select where in your yearbook ladder these pages will go. So I'm gonna find some blank pages to submit them to. And now that I've found the section I would like to submit them to, hit the blue Submit Pages to Yearbook button. Hit OK if you confirm this location of the pages. And you'll see now that it is assigning my pages. And they've been successfully submitted to my ladder. So I'm gonna go back to Manage Ladder and scroll down to the location where I uploaded them. And you'll see that the previews are generating, which may take a few moments. And here are my four pages. 
And that's how you export and submit pages from InDesign to Entourage Yearbook Slatter. If you have any questions about this process, don't hesitate to reach out to us at 888-926-6571, extension 2 for tech support. Check out for more help videos and thanks for watching.